What's up guys? How we doing? Welcome back once again to the channel and welcome back to another reaction video. Today we're focusing on a Seahawks player. He's on the defensive side of the ball. He's, uh, he's an enforcer. Well, I assume he is. He's a linebacker for the Seahawks. He comes in at number 67 on the list. His name's KJ Wright. What is that short for? All of that and more will be revealed. But first, a quick word from our exclusive video sponsor, Manscaped. Sup guys, it's Jacob here. Thank you, first and foremost, for clicking on my video. Secondly, this video is proudly brought to you by Manscaped. Now Manscaped do have a complete range of products on their website, but their most recent product, and the one that I'm using at the moment, is this, the Lawnmower 4.0. So not only is the packaging impressive, but apparently, it's a whole new balls game. And here it is now, the latest addition to Manscaped's incredible selection of male grooming products. I've been using the products for a good couple of weeks now. I love them. There's no way I'd be making this video if I didn't. Manscaped use ceramic blades with skin safe technology, which means there's absolutely no risk of nicks or cuts. In fact, you could probably do it blindfolded. Not only that, but you can do it in the shower also. It's completely 100% waterproof and it's even got an LED light. So power or no power, you can still get the job done. For those wondering, is it a tool just for the downstairs area? No, no it's not. It's actually good for your entire body, including your face. And for anyone wondering, that's the length. But if that's too short for you, there are four different trimmer guard options, which means four different lengths, which means if you really wanted to, you could probably even draw a picture. It looks good, it's waterproof, it's rechargeable with a 90 minute charge, and it's only one of the incredible selection of products on the manscaped.com website. So head over there, check out www.manscaped.com, use code JACOBD20, that's J-A-C-B-D-2-0, for 20% off your entire order. Join myself, your other favourite YouTubers, and over 2 million men worldwide happily using these products. Once again, head down into the description box below, click the link, check out the entire range of products, use my discount code, happy days. Enjoy the video guys, and peace out. And now that the formalities are over, I wanna say cheers. Nothing like a, a, nice, a nice wee hot coffee on a cold day to boost the spirits. And I'm led to believe there's nothing like KJ Wright when he's on form. So with that in mind, let's check him out. We got a tackle, we got a tackle. Hey, good ass, fellas, good ass. Turbo set. That guy's a linebacker? Are you sure? It's not a defensive end, is he? Looks more like a left tackle. Or maybe he's the Taysom Hill of the Seahawks and gets thrown absolutely everywhere. Let's find out. That is one big, big linebacker. KJ Wright is the poster child for what happens when you successfully teach an old linebacker new tricks. Oh, In 2020, okay. the 10 year veteran made a position switch because of injury. Instead of filling his preferred weak side linebacker spot, Wright played the majority of the season at strong side linebacker. Knowing a guy like him is on the field, make sure and that you don't fall asleep. If you fall asleep, he might get you. I got a little better, man. Adam's going to get it again. K.J. Wright is right there to meet him when you watch that play the first time. It's like, why didn't they account for K.J. Wright? Well, they tried. K.J. just threw the guy to the ground like a wet dish rag. Yeah, he's like a big... So I'm assuming strong side, as far as linebackers are concerned, I've, I've, only heard of, I've only heard of a strong safety. Would a strong safety play more so of a man-on-man -man role, whereas a free safety is, you know, locking down a, a, a zone of the field? I'm not quite sure, but we will confirm. Big D lineman, man. Able to come down here and deliver a thump and make you feel it. Bum! What's up, KJ? He's a savvy vet. Hang on. Did he just say he's a defensive lineman? Man, man, able to come down here. Like a wet dish rag. Yeah, he's like a big D lineman, man. He's like a big D lineman. And that's uh, that's pretty much my sentiment, Trey. Able to come down Agreed. here and deliver a thump and make you feel it. Bum! What's up, KJ? He's a savvy vet. And uh, those guys are dangerous. He'll lay the hammer if he needs to. He is knocked on his wallet <laughs> oh, by KJ shit. Wright. Wright is that is a big hit. Debut on the top 100. In 
part because he was the only player in the NFL to record double-digit tackles for loss and passes defensed in 2020. Fourth down and two. Wentz out of the shotgun, looks near side, ball is slapped down. K.J. Wright said, no way. He's a competitor, he's going to compete against you. Just a he's an athletic competitor too. And with that in mind, let's look up his stats. K.J. Wright, also known as Kenneth Bernard Wright Jr., is an American football linebacker who is a free agent. So he's been let go, even though he had such a stellar year. Six foot four, 246 pounds. Went in the fourth round of the 2011 draft with pick number 99 to the Seahawks and played his entire career at the Seahawks. Now, if nothing else, that does make me happy. He's listed as having rather small hands for a guy that's six foot four. Of nine inches, 4.75 for the 40 yard dash, 32 inch vertical jump, 10 foot on the broad jump, and 20 reps on the bench press. The Seattle Seahawks selected right. In the 2011 draft, he was the 13th linebacker selected. On July 29th, 2011, he signed a four-year, $2.52 million contract. On December 18th, 2014, the Seahawks signed Wright to a four-year, $27 million extension. On March 24th, 2019, Wright signed a two-year, $15.5 million contract extension with the Seahawks. And it seems as if he played out that final two years. He's an absolute Seahawks legend. He's played 144 games, 941 combined tackles, 13 and a half sacks. He's got 11 forced fumbles, nine fumble recoveries, six interceptions, and 54 passes deflected. This man is an absolute machine. No wonder they wanted to keep him on the field at all costs. Kenneth Bernard Wright Jr. I wonder if it's all over. I wonder if it's all over. Down. Keeper by Murray and he's going to go down. Back. Now, I don't know what kind of injury he had, but he's not showing any signs of it. Back at the 45 yard line, KJ Wright. You well, actually, we, we can probably read about that. Pretty sure he suffered a, a, a knee injury in 2018. A knee injury in 2018, but there is no additional information. Can't do it any better than that. As good of an open field tackle as you'll ever see. That's one of his 54 passes deflected. <laughs> Damn. Although the former Seahawk remains unsigned, will likely find a new home in 2021. Well, I hope so. I don't think he has yet. What you did for us this year... You want to play out there and not do what you want to do? Yeah. That's a real problem. Yeah. I don't understand the respect I have for you. Yeah. Chris, yeah. You, know, you played basically a D-lineman for us. Yeah. But that was the best thing to do. Yeah. Yeah. Man. Well, I really appreciate that little insight there, but what I do want to know is who is Burr Curvin? Is he a fellow linebacker? He is. And he's out for the season. Six foot, 230. Got picked up in the 2019 draft, but he's speaking like a veteran. <laughs> he's got a 4.56 40-yard dash, so if he does piss KJ right off, at least he can run away. But unfortunately, on August 23rd, literally a week ago, he suffered a torn ACL in the preseason. For fuck's sake. This game, man, this game is a roller coaster of emotions. And I am told that when you come into the league, if there's one guarantee that they give you, one guarantee... It's not your contract, it's not wins, it's not yards, it's not even money. It's the fact that you're going to get injured. And with that in mind guys, it uh, brings us to the end of another video. So I hope you enjoyed that one as much as I did. In the next one we're looking at, well, do I ruin the surprise or not? Fuck it. It's JJ Watt and he's listed as a cardinal. So that, my friends, is going to be a good one. So like the video if you have enjoyed it. Head down into the description box below and check out fanatics.com for all of your NFL gear needs. Click the link, make a purchase, supports the channel. Easy done. Thanks guys, and I will see you on the next one. Peace out.